Okay. We're back. And we've got the whole floor cleaned out. So far, so good. Uh, yeah, so now I just gotta get all this stuff and that stuff and that stuff and all the buckets and all the dispensers and then move all of the stuff up and we will be good. So go ahead and do that and I'll see you shortly. So we are back with an update on this right here. So um, I got all of the crafting benches and all the chests moved up here and things. And I have started working on this roundabout tower. So yeah, so I think what I'll end up doing is four steps per level, like four stairs per level with a block in between. So it'll be like one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, work on that. And you know, I'll cut back when, uh, when I have something to show. So yeah. So far it's going uh, pretty good, I think. Okay, so I decided to build this thing on camera. Okay. So it's going to go like this. So yeah, so that's basically how it's gonna just gonna work up a central pillar, and it's gonna go step, platform, step, platform, step, platform, step, platform, just like that all the way up until I get to wherever I want to be. Yeah, so I will go ahead and do that. Oh, and I think I'm gonna do the sides out of uh, glass panes. I think I gotta make some of those first. But yeah, so uh, I'll definitely get at least this much all kind of like framed in with the glass panes. Maybe uh, get some stuff done and then I'll be back with an uh, update. Yeah, that didn't take nearly as long as I thought it would. So I think this is, uh, is going to work out just fine. Doing it this way because uh, it only takes three... Four, five, six, and then the top row is nine. So nine per window. Yeah, I think I like this. I mean, I probably should have done some kind of stained glass, but that still looks pretty good. All right, I'm gonna finish the uh, the tower. I don't know how how high I'm gonna take it, but I'm gonna do that, and I will return in a moment. See you then. All right, so I have three levels built for the crafting bench in, throw a torch up. It's nighttime now. Oh, shoot. Uh-oh. Lightning creepers. So, yeah, so... I think I might build one more level and then uh, figure out what I'm doing. I mean, I know what I'm doing, but figure out what how I'm doing what I'm doing.
pretty good. Crap, enough wood. So yeah, so that's going to do it for this part. Hello, 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 and welcome back. So I have been hard at work on the tower. And as you can see, it's huge. Very, very big. Very big indeed. So I've decided that um, I think what I'm going to do is tear down this farm and tear down that farm and move them both on top of the um, the, the thing, um, the, you know, the thing, the uh, mob farm. And then it'll be all automated and then that'll free up all that space over there for other activities activities or something and yes so uh let me just take you up real quick so here is the inside of the tower going up going up going up going up going up going up so uh i was i'm, I'm kind of annoyed that i had to um, relocate the uh ah, relocate the uh mob grinder farm thing uh, xp whatever yeah this thing and so I went ahead and built a uh, like a test version on a creative world. Oh, there's the thing that's super annoying. So yeah, so I went ahead and built a uh, test version on the creative world, and I figured out that it will take exactly this many blocks. Well, I say exactly. It'll take roughly this many blocks from here to where the tower ends all the way down there in order to kill the mob. So... If I, uh, okay, fall into the water. And if I go ahead and use the level that is roughly even-ish with up there, then I can, unfortunately, because I already started doing this, I can place the, like, kill room, I guess is the, what I'm going to say, over there. But it's going to be a giant uh, eyesore. It's going to be... Yeah, it's, it's not going to look great. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm thinking what I'll probably end up doing is getting rid of all of this here and just moving it up to the top, and then I'll have warming up there because it's going to be really quite large. So, uh, yeah. I uh, I know that it's going to take, like, a long time and a lot of resources, so I'm going to be coming and going, and I'm not going to do this all in one sitting because that's just insane. Um so yeah, so I will probably get some of it done and then come back uh, when some of it's done. But uh, but yeah, so I just wanted to give you guys an update. And here's the update, and you've been updated. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are seven levels. Ugh, it's ridiculous. So yeah, I hope my math is right. But either way, that's definitely high enough when you take into consideration how much further you have to get to the ground. So yeah, and all this farm is going to be is just a big pad up top with dispensers that shoot out water once the mobs spawn inside of the area, and then they'll corrugate into a central channel, and then they'll fall down, and they'll have like a heart or half a heart left, and then I will proceed to punch them to death or use like a stone sword or something, and then they will die, and I will get their XP, and all will be well. And then I already have 22 levels from all of the stuff. And I haven't died lately, so yay. And then once I have all of the levels, I can enchant better armor. Which, mm, and then we can, with better weapons, armor, and gears and things, go over there to the ocean monument and kill all of the things. So, uh, yep, that's kind of a, a little bit of a recap and stuff. So I'm going to get to work, and I will see you guys later.